Dude, he's gonna come at the boat. Dude, he's gonna charge at the boat. Oh, that's a fish. That's gotta be a hit. First bonita in the boat. Probably not the last. Nope. Wow. Glider in. Nice. Oh, we're on, Jason. Yeah. You know that's not a king. Ain't no king, boy. Oh, it's coming up. Man, we can't escape the bonitas. They really did come early this year. We usually don't get bonitas till June, usually. No, I'm telling you, man, it's We have the ultra rare bonita. Super rare. You ready? Let's get this sick shot. I'd say that's a hit. It went down, dude. Look at my line. Oh yeah, your line went all the way to the right. Look at that. Little dolphin? I don't know. I don't know if it's swimming at me. Dude, we're on. We're in the fish. This one's on. Dave, get this jig rod for me. Oh, dude, it was going straight oh, down. It's dipping. Your, your line just broke your reel. What the hell? What'd you do? Your line just broke your reel. How? It, it literally you want to get that jig rod? Yeah. It's a blackfin. Look at look at peg fins. It's a blackfin. Oh, yeah. It's a nice blackfin, Jason. Yeah, I know. That's what we just lost. Ow, right? F my life. You don't got to wait on the dude. Huh? No wait. wait. No wait. Dang, man. We just lost Probably like a 10 pound blackfin. Yeah, that was definitely a blackfin. Yeah. Nice one, right? He didn't fight that much. He was freaking out. When I hooked up was big, I had some weight. That's the whole thing. I put head one second. Just like that. <laughs> wow. What is going on, man? We are in a funk. We are in a funk. We just lost that. Jeez, man. Nice. Nice. Oh, I'm pissed. I'm pissed. Yeah, it's literally hooks just pulled right there. This right here is why we. I'm coming, I'm coming. That right there is why we lost that black fin. That, uh, which one? On this one? Oh man. That ain't no bone. No. You're not tangled on me. No way. Woo! That's a big king, dude. That's a big king. That's a big freaking king. They got sharks. No, that's a big king. Oh, you might have gotten sharks. I don't think so. All I know is you're not tangled. Big king, dude. That's a big, no, that's king. big king. That's a big king. Exactly what kings do. Yep. Right. Wow, I can't wow. believe that. So the tip was wrapped. It's a good thing we didn't lose it in the future. Oh, so whoa, I can't whoa, fish whoa. this one. I almost went in my reel. Okay. Um, but yeah, I'll so, be ready with the gas. So we lost that fish not because of... You not here, here. Of, go ahead. Say for the camera. So we lost that fish not because of angler error. Just putting that out there. Tip nope. was cracked. Popped the second I put tension on the fish. Yep. Easily a 20-pound blackfin. Yeah. So that's that's history. But now we oh, got Jason, new. Jason's got a nice king on. That's all you need. Woo! Jason! Cut. Come on! <laughs> Today is not our day! <laughs> uh, what the heck? If it kinked, I'm gonna be pissed. Bro. That was a big kink. Bro, that was that. It was... might have just got sharp. Just think about it, it just took off out of nowhere. Uh, that uh, dolphin? Yeah, yeah, I got shark. Yep. Did you? Yeah. Because I had like two feet of I had two feet of um... you're, you're completely slacked. You did get sharked, didn't you? Yep. Yep. You got completely sharked. Dang. Man, oh, today. No. Do you think my uh do you think my leader broke? No. The knot? No. That's a clean cut, dude. That looks like just like a shark right there. Really? Yeah, that I would say that's, that's not a, shark. a knot Because you saw how he started really screaming at that's the end. That's not a yeah, that's I mean he freaked out out of nowhere. That's not my knot I've popping, seen, you think? I've seen your knots and your knots are generally good, so So that's what I was talking about. That tip right there is cracked, and so as soon as we put tension on the line, that 20 pounds just frayed right there. Pop subs for the win. When you're having a rough day, offshore, break out the pup sub. Bite? Just like that. Oh, that's a fish. Babe, get this jig rod. <laughs> that's the word of the day. Babe, get this jig rod. Oh, my oh. God. <laughs> no way. That was insane. Dude, that's on your deep line. Holy smokes. The thing is flipping. 
Dude, he's going to come at the boat. Victor, help out. Victor, help out with the I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. No, no. Get, get, my, get my girlfriend's... Uh... Oh, my gosh. Dude, talk about a show. Let me see. Yeah, but... Dude, he's going to charge at the boat. This thing is just... Wait, I need it. It's over or under. Which way? Yeah, see what I'm saying? Which way is it? Here, bring your rod tip towards me. Bring your rod tip towards me. Left, left, left. It's like this. Wait, okay. You got that on video. Sick. Oh my, dude, he. I thought he was gonna jump in the boat. I thought he was gonna jump in the boat. Watch out! Watch out! Here, can you hang this up? It's wrapped around this. Just I'm getting it. I can't believe he stayed hooked after jumping that many times and being that slack. He's not gut hooked. He wouldn't be fighting like this. I know. He had a six ounce egg flopping on his face. Flopping. This it's funny. Me and Jason were saying how. We kind of take it, take it for granted, these sailfish, like we, we're trying to catch meat fish, we're trying to catch eating fish, and you can eat sailfish, but it's a lot to kill if you're not going to cook it all. And people pay thousands of dollars and come to Florida just to catch sailfish, and here we are just like, like who me. wants to fight it? You want it? Who wants to fight it? No, no. <laughs> Turn them. Wow, that's a bigger one. Yeah, that's a... He's going to run. There he goes. I hope he doesn't stab me in the face. Exactly what I called. You want to go the other side try to get him? Take these rods. Whoa. Just go under. Oh! That's so cool. Good day! Good, good day! day. Hook's right there in the yeah, corner. Got you got it? Yeah. Okay. Beautiful fish. Yeah, this one, definitely not a small one. I'm gonna try to get that out, I'll hold him. This is a very green one. You got it. It's, it's gonna come right out. There Just like that. That was easy. Just like that. And is he wrapped up in it? Nice no. release here. Damn, he's blue. That's when you know that you did a good job. Yep. When, when they're go. blue like that. Get on your, get on your way, Mr. We Sarah. honestly, we didn't even have to turn the boat on because we, dude, that was good. Right, that was good. Nice. Yeah. Good job. Nice. When they're blue like that, that means you didn't fight them for a long time. You didn't horse. You didn't uh, no, putting too much pressure on them. Oh. He's swimming away strong. Oh, it's jumping, it's a sail. You see it? Another sail fish. Oh gosh. Wow, we hit that fish. That was a cool jump. Is that the sail? No, dude, look at where my line is. I think the Avid might have the sail, Jason. Really? Yeah. I don't know. Or not. I don't know. Yeah, dude, look at this fish. This fish is like over here. God, it might have just. Might, you think the scope it. was that much? No. There's no way. That has to be your fish. Yeah, it has to be the sail. Let me know if you need to go. Yeah. You filming? Yeah, I'm on. Alright. I'm recording. Two sails. Alright, so. He doesn't know he's hooked yet, that's for sure. Sails want the pilchards today. Woo! Oh, I love that. I love that. Oh, you know that sport fish just saw us hooked up, too. Yeah, he's turning right towards us. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's moving. Oh, he jumped again. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, I do have some. Oh, he's so pissed. A lot of salad on my line. I don't think so. I'm way out there now. Want to see a sailfish catch and cook? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I will. I honestly do want to do a sailfish catch and cook one day, but I need a smoke really. Em. You need a big smoker. One. You need a no, big smoker. No, those got worms. No, I'm saying you need a big smoker. Oh, yeah. So much meat. Too smoker. much meat. So, you guys will see a catch and cook on this channel with a sail sometime in the future. I just need to get my hands on a nice smoker. These fish are powerful. It's all about the tail. You look at a fish's tail, and that's how you guys can tell if it's going to be a fighter. They have that giant V-shaped tail. And that fish is literally fish. glued into that current. Oh, yeah. Putting his face into it and just yep. going. There's so there, a there's, a, yeah, there's a rip right there where the blue water turns into the green water right here. You got all the intercoastal water in here, and then you have that blue, nice uh, Gulf Stream water, and he wants to stay in that blue water. Oh, he's real close, actually, really, really close. Fish. Oh, he got his yep. stomach. 
Yeah, yeah we're gonna spit his stomach out, didn't it? We're gonna take that hook out. That's a little smaller one than the one you caught. You okay? This one's too glued up. Here, get the hook uh, out if you can. I don't want to swallow. I don't want to swallow the stomach. Here. Bring him back there. There we go. Oh, you got it out? Hey, buddy. He'll, he'll, that'll go back in there. <laughs> Put his stomach back in. <laughs> there he goes. Oh, dude, he just shot off yeah, like did. crazy. Nice. Good job. Nice. Two for two on sales. I've never actually All right. What's going on guys, Victor here, and you guys just saw the sailfish video of me and Jason. We went offshore today. I'm currently on the beach. I completely forgot to film an intro or an outro, so this is the outro you guys are going to get. But it's funny, you, kind, you guys kind of saw the negativity and me and Jason were really frustrated in today's video and today's trip was because when we're out there and we're, we have a specific goal in mind, me and Jason in springtime in South Florida, we're trying to catch a lot of meat fish, so we were really trying to get dolphin. We lost those two tunas. One of them was out of our control. I, com I did not notice that my rod tip was uh, cracked, and so what ended up happening is as soon as Jason put it, the reel in gear and tightened up on the drag, it just instantly popped. The other one, I don't know what happened to that black fin where the hooks just pulled right there at the boat. That was sad, because that was, that was dinner, you know? That's what we were out there to do. But we did have a good day. We caught two sailfish. We did not jump off two sailfish. We actually caught and released and had those two beautiful fish swim away. We got the hooks out. One of them, um, what's actually really common in sailfishing, I have a lot of friends who fish tournaments and a lot of sailfish guys. Sailfish, I don't know what it is about them, but a lot of the times you end up hooking them in the stomach. And when you hook these particular fish in the stomach, they'll actually spit out their stomach. And if you guys see in the video, that sailfish stomach was actually out of its throat. And that's not something we can control. That's just a part of fishing and it happens. But we did get the hook out and Jason tucked his stomach back in. And that fish should live. Um, I think it's a natural thing for them to do. And I think they are able to put it down back in their throat. It's not like a human where if we coughed up our stomach, obviously we'd be gushing blood and dying. But. So we got those two sails. No dolphin out there. Got cut off by a really big king. And it's springtime. I mean, every single trip we've been going offshore, it has been good. I mean, the rods have been bent. But any day now, guys, it's gonna hit the fan and you guys are gonna see a meat mayhem of just, we're gonna come back to the dock and it's gonna be tunas and mahi and hopefully some cobias and we're just, we're gonna have a good time. That's what I'm really waiting for. It's gonna happen, so stick around. If you guys enjoyed this video, sorry I didn't do a catch and cook. I know a lot of the new subscribers that are here are probably here because of the catch and cooks, but don't worry, those are still coming. I really enjoy cooking and enjoy sharing those recipes with you guys. So until that next video, stay salty my friends and I'll be seeing you in the next one.